with Sudbury's own arts and entertainment program. And a happy birthday to Vicki Belfiore. Had a big birthday this week. Thanks, and, Jack. <laughs> you know, if I had given you a birthday present, I would have given you the beautiful pennant you are now wearing. Isn't it nice? Isn't that beautiful? Bonnie Phipps is here with us today. She's got all kinds of jewelry. Mm. And uh, believe it or not, this is made of, um, let me see if I get, if I remember this correctly, it's fluted black onyx mm -hmm. and hand-carved cinnabar. It's a genuine gemstone. Yeah, and uh, Bonnie has a whole lot of these uh, gemstones that we're going to be taking a look at in just a bit. But first of all, I'm going to go to set number one. We're going to talk about the Sudbury Symphony, their upcoming Christmas concert. We're going to talk about the restoration of the old bridge at the Laurentian University Museum and Arts Center. And we're going to visit last Saturday, Celebrity Artists at Work. That's all coming up in just a second after you tell the folks what else is happening. And we've got a full set. Thanks, yeah. Jack. A really full studio today. We've also got, I mentioned Bonnie Phipps, first of all, she's got all kinds of jewelry to show us. As well, we have Cheryl Sari, some entertainment from her. And she's going to make us feel like it's Christmas, even though there's not much or any snow out there. And as well, we've got Barbara Miento from the Blue Society joining us. Perry Lynn, our usual guest every week. We're also going to do a movie review for you. That's Jack and I. And uh, right now, Jack's going to take it away. She's got Donna St. Jules with her, uh, with him. <laughs> Ralph McIntosh. Sorry, Jack. You confuse me. And uh, Bruno Wenzel as well. And they're going to talk about the Sudbury Symphony Christmas concert. <laughs> and Ralph McIntosh. You can't forget Ralph uh -huh. as well from Sudbury Secondary, who uh, is the arts and, uh, and uh, performing arts program at Sudbury Secondary. And your choral group will be performing with the Sudbury Symphony. We'll be talking about that in just a very few minutes' time. But first, Donna, welcome. Glad Thank to you have very you much. From nice Sudbury to be here. Arts Council. And uh, your T-shirt, the Celebrity Arts Class of 93. That's right. Sudbury Arts Council. We have a bit of a clip here. We're going back to Saturday. and Take a look at those artists. Uh, and they really did just a terrific job. We're going to take a look at them at work at City Center. And uh, I was a celebrity artist uh, about... Two years, two uh, years ago, two you years were ago, right? you were one of our first celebrity yeah. artists, our 1991 class. Now we're going to take a look at the class of 93 on our monitor and at home on your TV sets and see just how well our artists did. Well, thanks a lot. Oh, thanks. <laughs> Here they are, and uh, mm -hmm. <laughs> you might hear the talking in the background. Mm -hmm. It's Karen Shaw. and uh, There's a lot of laughing in the background yeah. as well. Lozia Doe is teaching counselor Karen Shaw and also Ron McDonald some techniques in acrylic. Carol That's, Mulligan. Yes, and Conrad Bobby, Bobby Wash, her instructor. He also instructed Dr. Sean Costello. And she was proud of her piece, signed it right away. That's Charlie Rapsky instructing um, Susan Paquette. And he also instructed um, Peter Millette from the MCTV show. And there's a list of some of our sponsors for the event. And there's Peter there. Look at this. Look at it's this. It's a marvelous it's piece, terrific, yes. Huh? Maybe he should give up uh, his he, newscasting. He might have to think about that, <laughs> yes. <laughs> Jerry Lahey Jr. and Peter Desolitz, they laughed quite a bit. They were learning how to draw from Karen E. Little. And you can see later on in the tape, they're quite intent on what they're doing. It's Dave Sturgeon from Q92. Him and Melanie Dahl, both from the morning show, learned from Brian Adio. They did some marvelous watercolors. Mel's stirring up her paint here. Mm -hmm. She looks very serious there. <laughs> she did a wonderful landscape piece. That's Dave's daughter giving him some instruction. He mm -hmm. learned from the best. Maury Brown from Northern Cable. He was in our class of 1991 as well. Mm -hmm. You can see some of the pieces here as they're finishing them. Looks like it was a success. It certainly was. It was a lot of fun. I'm hoping Brian's talents will rub off on me. <laughs> I ran home and painted that night. It didn't work. <laughs> we did have a lot of fun with the class. I'd like to thank our sponsors. We had TJ's Donuts, Northern Life, the Lougheed family and staff, Q92 FM, MCTV, Inco Limited, the Sudbury Star, and Remax Crown Realty. How intense can you get? That's Peter. Yeah. <laughs> Peter said he was, I was talking to him today, he said he's going back and do even more work on, uh, on his line drawing. Yes. That's an overview uh, from the top of the elevator, and that was it. That was it. Terrific. It was a lot of fun. Now, these pieces of art, I understand, are going to be on sale. That's right. We're going to auction them, actually, at our Mayor's Mother's Day brunch in May at the Senator mm -hmm. Hotel. We Great. do a blind bid auction. Mm -hmm. We're hoping to raise $5,000 for the Sudbury Arts Council. Maybe you might have two more candidates.